Hello everybody, today we're going to be doing a Pilates core series. These are classical postures and I really think that these five ab exercises are so good for building strength around the whole body. Let's start lying down. So lying down, supine position, flat on your back. First, just release into the mat, really feeling your hips, feeling your shoulders, making contact with the mat. Now bend your knees, hug your knees into your chest. You can rock side to side, massage the, massage the lower back. Keeping the knees into your chest, start to tuck the chin slightly into your chest as you lift the head and the shoulder blades off the floor. Take the arms behind your head interlace the fingers behind the head and let the head rest into your hands so your neck is not overly flexed or it's not overly extended so it's somewhere in the middle neutral neck you're looking up towards the ceiling can you come up a little bit higher on your shoulders engaging your core keeping this keeping your neck neutral take the hands to your right knee left leg straight now hover the left foot off the floor and pull the right knee into your chest. Switch, left knee into your chest, right leg straight. Switch, single leg stretch. Switch, make sure your neck is neutral. Switch, shoulder blades off the floor. Switch, good and switch. Curl up a little bit higher, left side switch. Right side, good, left side, point your toes. One more time each side, right and left. Good, hold here. Now straighten your left leg up towards the ceiling. Interlace the hands behind the shin and start to pull the leg in towards your head. Curl up a little bit higher with the shoulder blades. Neck stays neutral, hold here. Now both legs straight, we switch. Right leg comes up, switch. Good, switch. Switch. Change, keep switching. We go for five, mm -hmm. four, keep going. Three, neck neutral. Two, last one. Good, both legs straight. Slowly paste your spine back down and lower the legs all the way down to the mat. Rest. Now going for your double leg series, bend the knees into your chest. Take the hands behind your head, interlace. Now slightly tuck the chin into your ch chest as you peel the neck off the floor, lift the neck off the floor, peeling the shoulder blades off the floor. Come up to your highest and stay here. Now make sure your neck is neutral. Keep the shoulder blades lifted. Now hug the knees to your chest keeping the shoulder blades high. From here, straighten your legs, arms straight by your side. Hold this, bend the knees, knees to chest. Again, knees straight, arms straight by your side. Bend the knees, hug in. We go for five. Neck neutral, hug it in. Four, extend, hug it in. Last three, legs straight. Last two. One more, last one, hold it here. Arms straight, legs straight, come off your shoulders a little bit more. Stay for three, two, one, knees to chest. Pace the head down and rest. Now take your hands behind your head, interlace the hands behind your head. Now again, peel, tuck the chin into your chest and then lift the head off the floor. Now start to peel the shoulder blades off the floor while keeping your neck neutral. So gaze is up towards the ceiling. Keeping this, feeling the core start to fire up. Straighten both legs up towards the ceiling, both legs straight. As much as you can, can you push your thighs forward? Keeping this, lower both legs down, hover above the floor, and then come back up. Lower again, keep both legs straight and back up we go for five good four 
Mm -hmm. Keep going. Three. Lift the shoulder blades high. Two. One more. Last one. Hold here. All the way up. Bend the knees and slowly release. Keep the hands resting behind your head. Keep the knees bent. Last one. Tuck the chin into your chest. Lift the head up. Shoulder blades to curl up. Keeping your neck neutral. Keep the knees tugging, tucking into your chest. Now, right elbow, touch your left knee. Right leg straightens, coming into a crisscross. Switching sides, left elbow, right knee, left leg straight. Switch. Change. Shoulder blades high, we go for five. Four. Three. Really feel the twist. Two. One more, last one. Good, and then both legs straight up. Slowly lift the, slowly lower the head down. Lower the legs all the way down to the floor. Arms down by your side, rest and release. Taking a few moments to get your breath back into your body. Inhaling through your nose. Exhale out through your mouth. Two more like that, inhale. Exhale. One more, inhale. Exhale. Good, slowly coming back up. Let's come into your downward dog. So hands are shorter width apart. Step the feet back and push the hips up towards the ceiling. Now very slowly bring your knees to the floor. Lie flat on your chest. Take the hands into a W shape. So the elbows are by your side. The hands are in a, like a widened position. Place the palms on the floor, rest the forehead down. Okay, we're going to counter those, those forward folds and core exercises with, with some back bends. So extension in the back. Keep the shoulder blades sliding down towards your lower back. Now slide your nose forward, lift the head off the floor, and then start to articulate the spine, lifting your chest up towards the ceiling. When you, come, when you can't go anymore, slowly pace the spine back down, upper back, neck, chin, and nose. Slide the nose forward, lift your head, slowly coming up to extension, just up to your shoulder blades. And then slowly pacing the spine back down, chest touches the floor, chin tucks in, forehead touches the floor. Three more, coming back up. Now I want you to put a bit of pressure into your hands, lift the elbows off the floor, coming into your full swan. Just go into how much you can go for today. Keep the neck neutral. Exhale, pace the spine back down. Elbows to the floor, chest to the floor. Vertebrae by vertebrae. Two more like that. Slide forward, lift your head up. Peel the spine slowly. Elbows come off the floor. Arms as straight as you can, looking forward. Slowly pace the spine back down to release. So we go for control. We go for precision. One more, slide the nose forward. Lift the head. Articulating through your spine. And then very slowly pace it back down. Hands to the floor, tuck the toes, push it back, downward dog. Bring the knees to the floor and then have a seat. Thank you so much for joining me on this flow today. I hope it was good for you and your body.